15, and our Chuck Lofton is here joining us because we are counting down the days until you and all of us get to see yes, the total right. solar eclipse. Yeah, and, you know, we've talked a lot about really how it's expected to be one of the most spectacular things yeah. that we'll see, I mean, literally in, in our, our lifetime, lifetime that, right? Yeah, that's not a stretch to say that. In fact, I can't wait. On Monday, I'll be going to the path of totality <laughs> where it is truly a cosmic total eclipse. Now, I'm heading, at least right now, to Golconda, Illinois, with a bunch of Butler students and professors, like 50 of them, wow. who are super excited about this all-American eclipse. Now, Butler's Holcomb Observatory is a great place to learn about the sun, stars, and astronomical events like the total eclipse. They have a huge observatory with telescopes, planetarium, all kinds of ways to see what's out there in the sky. Now, I talked with Butler astronomy professor Dr. Brian Murphy about what they're doing for people who want to learn more about what's happening Monday. We are going to have planetarium shows, telescope viewing uh, conditions permit, focusing in on this eclipse, how to view it, what people can expect. And if you're certainly heading totality, this would be really good for you because, you know, I've seen two of these and I know what to expect and we're going to be giving these shows on what to expect both for partial and totality. All of the things to look for in how to view this eclipse. And we really would love for you to see these, uh, these shows. They're going to be great. Those Holcomb Observatory shows begin tomorrow night. They're also Friday and Saturday. Thursday and Friday shows at 7 and 8 p.m., but the doors open at 6.30, so you better be there at 6.30. That's my, that's my pitch yeah. on Saturday, the first show at 4, then shows at 7 and 8. Now, you can also buy certified eclipse glasses at the observatory. They'll cost you $2. You'll find all of this information on WTHR.com slash Eclipse. Yeah, that is awesome. I mean, it, it looks incredible. And you were yes. telling me how cool this is right there on campus. And the fact that you're going with these Butler students is really, really neat. Yeah. These, these are astronomy students for the most part, physics students. So, I mean, they're way above my brain power. <laughs> so I'm they're going to pull really me on yeah, a leash yeah. through this. But actually, this is a once-in-a-lifetime event. And I've, I'm going to have some stuff up on Facebook a little bit later on today on the WTHR Facebook page. We know that the first time that totality ever happened in Indianapolis was in the year 1205. So wow. it, science is great <laughs> to be able to come up with that kind yeah. of stuff. But it's going to be great on Monday. All right. Well, 